Hello and welcome to another Diablo 4 episode here on the Mola P channel. My name is KS Mole, and today we have to talk about the item shop in Diablo 4. No, this is not a video where I would just tell you, oh my god, they are destroying the game, this is a $70 game, they shouldn't have an item shop, this is all shit, I want back the time where item shops were not in full price titles, I hate this. No, this is not such a video. Let's be real here. The item shop is here to stay. No matter what we are complaining about. It is part of the live service games and Blizzard is taking part of the money, unfortunately not all of it, but part of the money and put it back into more content for the game. So again, this is here to stay. This is not going anywhere. Do I like it? No. But hey, I also have to admit, I'm part of the problem. I have spent obscene amount of monies in video games over the years for cosmetics. I don't mind having some really cool cosmetics in an item shop for my character I'm playing, right? So no, this is not a video about another YouTuber complaining about that this item shop has to go, right? Not doing that. What I will do is the item shop needs some major improvements. One of the biggest one is the so-called microtransactions. Excuse me, 28 bucks for one skin is not a microtransaction. And now you might say, well, Mo, excuse me, have you seen some other games like PoE and, well, like League of Legends or Dota, where you pay much more than that? Sure, but you also get a lot for that money. If you are looking at the Wraith Lord, which is the most expensive skin, like this doesn't look bad, but 28 bucks? Like for 28 bucks, or to be more precise, for 30 bucks, I can get the whole Yakuza series right now on the PC. I can get Yakuza 0, 1 and 2 remake, 3, 4 and 5 remastered, and 6 all together for 30 bucks. Whoa, 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 whoa. That comparison is stupid because you are comparing a video game where you have to play different games for instead of with a skin in a game you really love. Like you are buying the skin because you want to be special. You want to be different. You want to have a status symbol and you really love to play a certain character, right? So you cannot really compare that with another game. And you were absolutely right. The game comparison wasn't necessarily the best one, but I have a much better comparison for that. I actually have a comparison for a game, and that is League of Legends. League of Legends has so-called ultimate skills. You can see one right here. This is for Lux and costs 25 bucks. So pretty close what you will get. And this skin is completely changing the looks of her the attacks, what she is saying, and the skin can actually switch between fire, nature, water, and every time the attacks change. And later on, you can actually combine skills like magma, nature, and fire, or you have storm, which is air and fire. And every time the attacks change, her animation change, and the teleportation is changing, and that's 25 bucks. And you can also see the character, right? You see the movement is changing and it becomes pretty clear that this skin doesn't have all of that. Now you might say, but Mo, I mean, look at that. The helmet alone is amazing and all that. Yeah, but you, you will never see the character like that. 99.9% .9 of the time, you're not looking at this. You are looking at this from a top view. And there's not much going on here for 28 bucks. And this brings us to the second point. Let me ask you something. And I really want some answers on that down below in the comments. How many people have you seen running around with skins? Because I have been looking for some people and I maybe have seen so far after hundreds and hundreds of hours playing this game already, a handful of people, not just with this skin in particular, but like a lot of those skins, 
I haven't even seen some of those skins in the wild yet. And I really have to ask the question, how many people are actually paying money for this? Like, how many people buy this? I have seen only one barbarian wearing this armor. One. In hundreds of hours of gameplay. Isn't that exactly what developers and in the end we players want who buy skins? You want to have skins which are recognizable. So there are two issues here. The first issue could be that there are not enough people who are actually buying the skins. Let's not hope that's the case because that's a problem. The second one, and actually that's not really better, people are buying those skins but they don't look anything special and so don't, you don't really spot them. Like, I will be completely honest. This is a 25 bucks skin. If, if I would see somebody showing up with that, I wouldn't even notice. Like, they, they are literally some skins in the game which are very similar. So yes, <laughs> Blizzard actually uphold their promise when they told us that they will have a wide variety of skins in the item shop and in the game and they will not force you to go into the item shop to buy your skins. And I do appreciate that because I have played a game where that is not the case. Black Desert Online. You want to have the really cool skins in that game? Well, you better go into the item shop because you will not find them in game. I can tell you that. Like... I'm not a fan of games who are doing that. So that makes sense. But is this really this whole package is worth 25 bucks? For, for what? It doesn't make me look very special, right? And so the two things which Blizzard really has to change is lower the prices like seriously, lower them and come up with skins which really make you stand out. There is a very similar skin like this in the game actually. And this is 18 bucks. Like give me some skills which are changing with the skin, right? Like give me something where people go Oh, wow, that looks amazing. Right? You don't have to put shit into the game to make the stuff in the item shop look better. Please don't do that. Please don't. But just saying, like, right now, <sighs> the price tag is too steep. Like, far too steep. You are asking a premium for something which is not necessarily premium looking. And even then... Um, a lot of time you will you will not really spot those skins in the wild because they are kind of forgettable right like I, I would love to put some money on the table if I find a skin I really enjoy this is not my point of uh, don't, don't have skin in your game like I don't like that no I I'm okay with spending some money on skins. I really do. This one here, as a druid player, wow, this looks a bit, this looks amazing, right? This looks actually really cool. But 22 bucks? Nah, man. <laughs> nah, sorry. Ain't gonna ain't gonna happen. And then it's only for one class. So it's this. <sighs> I would, I would love to, but the more I'm looking at the skins, the more I'm actually asking myself, it's a bit too steep. So please, Blizzard, lower the prices, and maybe that already helps. Maybe you don't have to do anything else besides of lowering the prices a bit, because it's, it's quite steep for what you're offering here. And there are other games who really have nailed down their skin game. Like even Path of Exile, where you have some really expensive skins, they're coming with so many amazing features and they are really a thing where people will go, whoa, that looks amazing. 
this looks cool, but there's nothing outstanding special about it, right? So I'm hoping they will improve on that. But please, let me know what you think about it down below in the comments. I will definitely read them. And But don't forget, be nice to each other. No need to be a dick here. And we're not on Reddit or on the Blizzard forums, just to make that clear. And with that said, please don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel. If you want to see more Diablo 4 content, uh, we are also streaming some Diablo here on the channel. Uh, some good old PvP we have been doing a bit. So if you want to check that out, you're more than welcome to do that. And with that said, thank you so much for watching. I hope I see you next time. Stay safe. Bye-bye.